Happy New Year, everybody. It's time to jump straight into the brand new content on EFC 24 in 2024. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable ultimate team coins, check out mmoexp.com. Link in the description, save 5% using code HABER. We have year in review player picks, 85 doubles, 84 times 20s, all the content. Let's see what we get in my year in review player pick. It's, of course, a duplicate Balak. At least we're getting icons, though. I'm going to take Lozano. I just think Lozano is, like, the best option there. I'm not going to take a Balak, am I? Uh, we'll take Lozano. I also did my 85 double upgrade. We're going to open that bad boy up and see what we get in that as well. Fingers crossed to win to wild card, but you never know. Uh, I wouldn't advise doing too many 85 doubles. I don't think they're actually that greatly priced, personally. Uh, we did get ourselves an Erdogan. Go, go be double walkout. Go. Yeah, double walkout. Let's go. Come on. Who is it? Who is behind there? Don't be Ruben Diaz. Anyone but Ruben Diaz, please. All black. 89. 88. 88. Okay. I mean, that's all right. We may we may have luckily broken even there. But I do think they're a little bit overpriced. Let's go to put some more packs on share play. All right. We have got Lala's year in review player pick. I mean, to be honest, I don't think Otavio is awful because he gets the perfect link to uh, Cristiano Ronaldo. He wants Van der Ven. That makes a lot of sense. I, I, Van der Ven. Uh, Van der Ven. Van der Boomen. Excuse me. Um, but yeah, I think uh, Van der Boomen is good because he's going to get upgrades. But I don't think that Otavio card is necessarily awful either. Because he gets perfect links to Cristiano. So if you do have a Cristiano, you might want that Otavio card at some point. Uh, we also have the 87 by 3 and the 84 times 20 for Lala as well. 87 by 3 first. What are we getting in this? It's going to be bronze or Trent? Oh no, it can't be Trent. What's wrong with me? We get bronze. And Irene Paredes, which means... Does that mean another 87 in there? Or... Yeah, it does. All right. Not ideal. Uh, swap the tradable dupes and discard the dupes. All right. 84 times 20. Come on, EA. Let's get a winter wild card in this 84 times 20, please. Obviously, this is for completing the daily login. Um, so if you did the daily login up to today, you get this for free, by the way, which I'm a big fan of. I think daily logins are awesome in the game. Uh, we get ourselves a couple of gold cards. Belgium, centre mid, Kevin De Bruyne. Ooh. Wait, who is this then? Is, who is the, who, wait, is this Messi? I don't know who this is. Who's going to be the double walkout? Haaland. Interesting. Okay. I didn't know what special cards were still in packs and which weren't. So that's what confused me. I didn't know if his inform was still in packs or not. Okay. Haaland. Very nice. What else have we got in this pack then? Wow. Now look at the fodder. It's actually pretty good. And Raspadori there in the dupes. That's a very, very good 84 times 20 for fodder, man. Like, you'll see if we open more of these. There won't be... They won't be as good as that, in my opinion, for fodder. That's a very, very good fodder pack. All right, now it's time for Mike's packs and pick, I think. Year in review first. Come on, let's get a good icon. Lee Kangin's not bad. I think that card looks decent. He's not insane. I feel like there, there, there are so... The only thing that keeps these year reviews exciting for me is the icons, because there aren't very many SBC cards. Um, there aren't many SBC cards that realistically are insanely exciting, bar you play them with the Bafes and whatnot. So the icons are what keeps it exciting. But like, what I like about them is you can get cards that are decent for SB, uh, sorry, for SBCs, for, uh, for future like squad building and stuff. Let's say you have a play of the month Son and a play of the month Mbappe in a month's time and you need to link them together. You've got a Lee Kang in there. That's perfect. That's why I really like them for like the future ability, I guess, of them. The potential for the future. Uh, Cobell gets discarded to the duplicate pile. I can't believe we still don't have duplicate storage on this game, by the way. It's 2024, yeah. Give us duplicate storage, man. All right, 84 times 20 time. We've got ourselves a Norwegian cam. The most common walkout in the game is going to be Erdegaard. But he is joined by Endler. Okay, not as good. This is what I mean. Like, double 91s is crazy. This is what I'm saying. This is why I got gassed about the last one. Um, Let's see if we have a winter wildcard, though. Ooh, we have two. Raspadori and Castellanos. Not bad. We'll take that. Two winter wildcards is all right. All right, we go again. We go again, EA. Come on. Let's get winter wildcards. Let's get... Winter wildcards. <laughs> Let's get some more winter wildcards. Bakayo Saka or Beth Mead? I'm going to say Beth Mead because Bakayo Saka is 86 rated. That's an 87 triple. Um, I'm going to do that a lot. I don't apologize. I keep forgetting it's 87 minimum. Yeah. Who's that? 
Another Irene Paredes, fair enough. Okay. So that means, yeah, we've got a Maggle as the third one there. Who is sadly going to the uh, non-existent duplicate storage. Let's go. All right, 84 times 20. Come on, the big one. Ooh, we have an inform. Let's go. Erling Haaland. That's also named Hergerberg. Same, same thing, you know, basically. They have the same, like, hair, you know? Uh, it's it's Hergerberg, who I keep forgetting exists. And then we have Patrick Schick's inform, who's like 86. That's pretty good fodder. That's actually solid for uh, for SBCs, to be fair. What do we have in the interim? In the rest of this pack, we've got a Rodri, we've got Mignon, Dybala, and a Yazabao. Another Winter World card. So we've had a 100% hit rate on Winter World cards so far. That's actually been solid. All right. On to Dario's now. 87 times 3. Here we go. Spain. Center back. Is that our favorite? Is that is that Mappy Leon? I mean, Irene Paredes, sorry. It is Irene Paredes. Is that like the third or fourth one in this pack? She's been in almost all of them so far. We got Rodri there as well. I'm guessing... I don't even know who's going to be the third one there. Cobell. All right, nice. So, Irene Paredes has got a crazy hit rate at the moment. She is in almost all of these 87 times 3s. So the weight is really, really high on her. All right, now for the 84 times 20. Here we go. England, right wing. That one could be Bakayo Saka. In fact, I almost bet that is Bakayo Saka. Oh, no, he's Beth Mead. All right, fair enough. All right, respect. And Manuel Neuer. What we got in the rest of these. So, double 87s. We want to see if the 100% hit rate for Winter Wildcards continues. And it does. Granted, it's only John Joe Shelby and Raspadori. Nothing too spectacular. But we still continue to get Winter Wildcards, which is nice. All right, my boy Tom's on Xbox. So we're watching this via stream. Let's see what he gets in his year in review. Player pick, Oscar. That L Oscar's holding is for the uh, is for the player pick he just opened for sure. Because that is um, that could have been better. That could have been a lot better. Let's see what he gets in his pack though. For his packs. Uh, 84 times 20. Here we go. He's got himself. Is that Bruno Fernandes? Or is that? Yeah, it's Bruno Fernandes. All right. Who is going to be the double walkout? 88. And then let's go for like a 90 or a 91. Go on. Be like a Benzema or De Bruyne or something. Come on. Who's that? I can never. I never know with the with the females. I actually never know. Hergerberg. All right. So it's, it's the fake Haaland. Brilliant. Oh, no. We lose. We lose the. 100% hit rate. All right, we go again. It's a shame that the 100% winter wildcard rate has unfortunately been failed. But maybe we can bring it back with the next 84 times 20. We've got a Neuer and who double walkout? Ruben Diaz is my guess. Kimmich. I was wrong. Uh, Kobel in the pack. Payor. It's kind of nice to try and guess it, though, isn't it? I, I don't know. I just like guessing it. All right. So we have another 84 times 20 here. Come on. What are we saying, EA? What are we saying? Here we go. Come on. Please, EA. Get us back to Winter Wild Card winning ways. That's an incredible iteration. Messi. No, it's not. It's uh, Dybala. 86. That's quite low rated. Come on. Give us a high rated walkout, please. 86 is low for the double walkout here. Rodri. Mm, 89's alright. Inform Providell's nice though. Hey, we're back. Lamptey, we're back. Come on. Alright. Next up, we have another year in review player pick. Come on, big icon, please, EA. I know John got a mere ham from this. So, like, Dino? Mm, okay, maybe not. We get us as a Hoitama? Hoitama? Oh, is she the one that used to go out with Alfonso Davies? Oh, man. Justice for Alfonso, guys. Justice for Alfonso. All right. Come on. Now we want to see a winter wild card in this 84 times 20. Please. Please. Yeah, she is. Okay. Right. Winter wild card. Wait, what? All right. I don't know if the store's working or not. The store is working for some people. I think the store is having technical difficulties. I imagine everyone's come on to open up their free 84 times 20s. And uh, the store is just not liking it at all. That's why I imagine. Uh, Cobell and Bruno Fernandes. We've not had a winter wild card in one of these 80, 87 times threes at the moment. Uh, Son is okay. He just gets gulagged, unfortunately. Um, he just gets uh, sent to the make-believe duplicate storage pile. 84 times 20. Come on. Winter wild cards, please. Rolfo on the front. You know what? I've, not pa I've actually never packed Graham Hansen this year. Not a single Graham Hansen this entire year. Uh, another Hergerberg, though. I've not packed Graham Hansen, and I've not packed um, Mbappe. I think they're the only two that I've not packed this year. Oh, boo. No winter wildcard, man. Come on. All right. 
we go again. 87 times 3. What do we have, EA? We have Portugal centre mid, Bernardo Silva. That's quite high, actually. So, 88 or higher for the double walkout. It's actually quite nice. We'll take that. Anything higher than 87 is quite nice. I just realised it is only one rating higher than the minimum. Who's that? Katoto. Okay, I'm glad Katoto didn't show up first. Um, Katoto. Oh, triple 88s. First time for everything. We get a first triple 88 pack. Let's go. This is good. This is this is good luck right here. This is great luck. Here we go. Come on. No. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, we got ourselves Kimmich. No, Urbadorf. I just realized I got upset about it not being a special card, but the winter world cards don't even show up. So I don't know why I got upset, upset about that then. Hergerberg and Urbadorf. Delict. It's not great. We do get Lamptey though. Is Lamptey worth anything? I think that's his minimum. Oh, no, it's not his minimum. Okay, like 25k-ish. I mean, we'll take it. Another year review player pick. Come on. Ronaldinho. I believe it. Middle slot Ronaldinho. Crazy how I just know. Uh, it's a weird looking Ronaldinho EA. Mario Hermosa. I haven't seen him once, actually. That card isn't horrendous. It's not great, is it, realistically? But it's not horrendous. <laughs> Copium? The amount of Copium on this channel. Like, you just you just overdose on Copium on this channel. Uh, you're taking Santos as well. Fair enough. I, yeah, right. Well, yeah, fair enough. All right. Next 87 plus times three and year in review player picks. Ooh, 280 plus player picks as well. The lucky 80, 80 plus player picks. Ooh, nice. 84. We'll take that. We'll open up a bunch of these like tomorrow or the next day as well and just see how they do. And we get another inform. That's actually really nice, man. Informs are like gold dust at the moment. So that is actually solid. All right. Year in review. It's got to be Lee Kang in. There's absolutely no no other choice there. We'll take Lee Kang in. I think the card actually looks all right. Like 90 pace, 90 on dribbling. I don't think that's a bad looking card either, to be fair. I like the uh, actual card design too. I think the Thunderstruck cards are absolutely gorgeous. I've seen like... So we're getting a Fire and Ice promo at some point soon. And like the card designs look incredible. I think this year... I mean, every year EA smash it with the card designs. But this year especially... They just look absolutely ridiculously good. So, fair play to EA. There's only been one or two car designs or promos where I've thought, eh, you know. The rest of them have just been, like, really, really nice. All right, 84 times 20 time. Swiss K. Borussia Dortmund. We get ourselves a Kobel, who is going to be the double walkout image. Nice. Nice. All right. No winter wild card, though. That's a shame. All right. Next year in review player pick. Come on, Icon. Two Icons. I think Zola is the pick there, right? Zola is, like, definitely the pick there, I think. Lampard, if you're a Chelsea fan, you know, or maybe you're just a fan of goals being disallowed that clearly went in. Maybe you take Lampard there. All right, next year in review player pick. Lozano? I mean, uh, you don't want Lozano. Fair, fair enough. He does not want... It. No, you don't want to discard it. All right, Trezeguet, welcome to the club. You know, the only French striker really you're looking for is Henri, if we're being honest. You know, I mean, actually, that's a lie. You kind of want Mbappe, don't you? He is a French striker. I meant French striker icon, but you know what I mean. Rolfo in the pack. What we got in the rest of this? Come on. Bernardo Silva. Okay. I mean, you know, he could have been a bit better. Could have been a lot better, actually. Hey, we got our first winter wild card. From one of these packs. Let's go. Our first one. That's that's a milestone right there, boys. That is a milestone. That is an achievement. All right. 84 to 20. Another winter wildcard, please. It's going to be all black on the front. Who is the double walkout? It's higher than 88. So that's a good start. Get like another De Bruyne or something. Another Morgan. Which is, I, I guess, fair enough. 89 rated. Who is in the rest of this pack? Come on. Winter wildcards. Yeah. Inform. Nice. Some walkouts. Okay. Good start. Yeah, ooh, two. Costage and Lamptey, we'll take it. All right, on to my second account now. We have a year review, then an 85 double. Let's see what we get in the year review pick. Come on. I'm going to take General because he's got potential to upgrade. But that is the worst year in review player pick I think we've seen today. That is terrible. That is absolutely awful. All right, uh, 85 double now, what we get? Here we go. French, centre mid, centre mid, who is this? Oh, there's a Paul Pogba. What? That is, wait, what? That is so confusing. That is so, I mean, we'll take Rabiot, but that was so weird. 
I thought we'd pack Pogba, and I thought, wait, is he even in the game anymore? That's crazy. All right, year in review now. Here we go. Come on, icon. Just be. I think it's impossible to be worse than the last one, right? Come on, icon, right here. Otavio, Lee Kang, and Giroud. I don't know why, but I feel like I didn't see a single Giroud or Otavio from any of the other year reviews that we've opened. I just don't think we've, we've seen any of them. I feel like they're brand new to the rotation. Might be wrong. If you've seen them, then let me know in the comments down below. All right, we go again. Number 87 times 3. Number 84 times 20. Here we go. If we get a double walkout in an 87 times 3. A do, sorry, a double two winter wildcards in an 87 times 3. Do they both walk out? Or will it be like that Rabio? That Rabio really confused me, actually. That was really weird. I didn't realize that had been happening. Uh, that's a bad. That's bad, by the way. That's 387. Ooh. Never mind. I take that back. I was like, that's triple 87s. I mean, yeah, it's triple 87s. But one of them's Winter Wildcard Saliva. That's really nice, actually. Fair play. That's really, really nice. Um, 84 times 20 now. Here we go. Come on, EA. Sort us out. Right here. We get Cobell. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, who's the double walkout? Come on. De Bruyne. Graham Hansen. Haaland. Mbappe. Can any of those even be there? Van Dyke. Van Dyke's all right. 89. Still one of the best CBs on the entire game, by the way. How is Gold Van Dyke still one of the best CBs on the whole game? He's a beast. But like, come on, EA. Sort us out. Get, give us some better CBs, man. Ah. Scary. That's all right. All right. John's 84 times 20 and 87 times 3. Now the store's working again. We uh, we tried to open it earlier, but unfortunately the store went down. So uh, we go again. 84 times 20. Come on. Brazil. Goalkeeper. That's a good start. That is a decent start. Edison. And. Go on. Be a 90 plus, please. We've not had a 90 plus in a while, actually. I don't think. Rodri, 89 again. Fair enough. A lot of Man City players in these packs. I'm not liking it at all. Let me see some United. Come on. Rafael Leao. There's Mary Erps. Go on. An inform, but no winter wildcard. Bit of a shame, really. Uh, it would have been nice if there was a winter wildcard in there. But an inform, you can't complain too much about, to be fair. Now it's time for the 87 times 3. Come on. Come on, EA. Here we go. Pop. Mm. Uh, 88, at least. And Bernardo Silva. Uh, maybe it's another Saliba situation. Potentially. It's not another Saliba situation. All right, Neves 84 times 20 now. Come on, EA. Win to wild cards, please. Victor Osman on the front is going to be an 88 plus. Oh, who do we? Who do you think it's going to be? Ruben Diaz is my guess. I'm going to guess Ruben Diaz. We've not had him yet. And I feel like he's in every single video. Who's that? To Stegen. I thought it was Chesley. To Stegen, 89. There's. Oh, there's no, there's no, okay, fair enough. Oh, okay, it's Alvaro. I don't know why I thought it was someone better. Now for 87 times three, it's going to be French striker, Ked Soto. Imagine Mbappe. There's the Ruben Diaz. I told you, I felt it in my bones. I told you. There's the Ruben Diaz. There he is. All right. We go again. EA. We go again. He's going to buy, look, he'll buy FC points if he gives him some good. All right. We promise. Who's this? Erdegaard? Why do I even have to ask? If it's Norwegian, it's probably Erdegaard. Erdegaard and let's get Hergerberg. Let's go for the Norwegian triple. Hergerberg, Erdegaard, Haaland. Come on. Never mind. Is that Beth Mead? Triple Arsenal? Ooh, another win to wildcard. I can't believe Rabio's 30k. Back in FIFA 17, that Rabio card would have been like 500k. That's mainly because we were still using gold 78 rated cards by this time in FIFA 17. So, I mean, it's understandable. All right. Germany. CDM. Josh Kimmich. Erbendorf again. I don't know why I asked. It's never going to be Josh Kimmich. He's too high rated for this. And Luka Modric. All right. Come on. Back to back winter wildcards, please. EA. Another informed profit. That was always nice. That is that is class. No winter wildcard, though. We've loaded in. This one's already opening. It's Renard and Bernardo Silva. I don't know if this is the 87 times 3 or the 84 times 20. I'm not entirely sure. We're about to find out. It's the 87 times 3. Hey, no dupes is a kind of a W, I guess. I don't know. I have no idea. Um, all right. 84 times 20. Here we go. Come on. Portugal. Center mid. Bernardo Silva again. 88. Who's going to be the second one? It's going to be Endler. 88 as well. Some 87s in there would be nice. Or one, 187. Another Val Valverde in there is not bad, though. 
I mean, no winter wildcard, but it's okay. Content right here. Year in review and two hero picks. Here we go. Vanden Boomin's class. We'll take him straight away. He is, apparently, the pro's doing really well with Vanden Boomin as well. So, upgrades galore, man. Here we go with the first hero pick. Ooh, that's actually a really good one. It, well, that's a really good one in terms of base heroes. Obviously, there's no triple threat, which is really annoying. But, Tevez and Paolo Futra, very, very nice. Both decent. Difficult choice. I think I'll go Paolo Futra. I think he's more usable. Uh, but, obviously, Tevez is class as well. Whoa, that was close. We both controlled at the same time there. You always talk to you some part. <laughs> oh, it's close. All right. Next hero pick. Captivia. Uh, nah, that's, that's kind of bad, to be fair. 